to Dancing with the Stars, the grand final. And happy Mother's Day, Jen. Oh, thanks very much, Sharon. Yes, it's another Mother's Day when my kids sit around watching television mm. and I'll do, you know, all the work. I had a facial earlier. It was exhausting. Mm. Happy Mother's Day to all the mothers out there. Yes, you have to say it. And sit back and enjoy the show. Yes, we have seen how all our finalists have risen to the judges' challenge. Now, they have to dance just one more time. The show dance gives our celebrities the chance to show us what they've learned over the past 11 weeks. Their dances should be creative, bold, yes. and ambitious. Mm -hmm. This is their last chance to take our breath away. First to take to the floor and hoping to show us that he's got what it takes to lift that trophy. It's Carl Mullen and Emily Barker. <laughs> Go in, quick cup of tea, mm -hmm. and then back to rehearsals. Okay. Oh my Hi. goodness, someone learned to open the door! Oh, no. oh yes! Mm -hmm. Oh, who are all these people? <laughs> yeah, I was really surprised because we were literally driving by the house, like, come on, we'll come in for a quick cup of tea, so I didn't know you'd set all of this up. <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> Emma's crying! <laughs> I'm not crying. Yeah. Oh, I just, I'm actually lost for words. Yeah, I'm really, really proud of you. Oh, thanks. <laughs> Every week we're just so proud of seeing you up there and I think your mum and dad love it. They just, yeah, they love it. Why am I crying? <laughs> yeah, the Mullins were all criers. Um, we wear our hearts on our sleeves. Dance. Is there room for two more? <laughs> and to top off this surprise, in walked my sister who flew over from London. I can't believe it, like. <laughs> Dad was just happened to be away this week at work, and I was thinking to myself, God, he, he'll hate that he missed this. And I just couldn't believe it when he walked in. It was so important to get back for Carl to support him, and I'm just delighted for him and Emily. It's been a great show. I'm delighted they brought joy to everybody. <laughs> this weekend is the one-year anniversary of my Nana, and uh, Nana passed away last year. She was a real central part of our family. We started the show on her birthday as well, which was funny, so sorry. I know that this weekend and this final means a lot to Carl and to his family. So we have to go out there, do this show dance and make his Nana proud. I'm just blown away by all of the support that we've got over the last three months. To lift the glitter ball on Sunday would be, would be absolutely magic. Dancing the show dance, Carl Mullen and Emily Barker. You see tonight, you can go either way Hearts balanced on a razor blade We are designed to love and break Then to rinse and repeat it all again I get stuck when the world's too loud and Things don't look up when you're going Tears on your last dance. 
we've seen how emotional and how much this means to you. Um, that was just stunning, wasn't it, guys? <laughs> Absolutely stunning. I mean, in 11 weeks, yeah. you learned to dance and your son learns to open the front door. Yeah. What scarier. I know, both equally as terrified. <laughs> oh, yeah, it's just been the most incredible 11 weeks, but like, it would have been nothing without making a friend like Emily through this whole thing. She's just been incredible. And honestly, like, she's taught me so much about backing myself, because I did not think I would get to the final. But she, from day one, believed in me, so she's been an incredible friend. We all believe time. in you, Carol. We all believe in you, Carol. Don't you worry. Carl, 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 you really put everything you have into this final performance, and it paid off! Yes. <laughs> it did! I just want to say thank you so much for being the energy, the fun, and the heart of this season. Thank you. You know? And I'm so delighted you choose Contemporary Ballroom for your show dance, because that was a side we never seen. What a treat to watch yeah. in the final. You really expressed yourself, both of you, and the lifts were so effortless. You light up every room you enter, and none more than the ballroom the past three months. It's been a joy to watch you. Thank you. Thank you so Thank much. You. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. It's done. The journey is finished, 11 weeks. You know, you started off on this road, and let's face it, probably neither of us thought you were going to get to the final. <laughs> but you're here, and you absolutely deserve your place. I mean, grandparents sitting with children all over the country watching the show tonight will be uh, mesmerised by that, as I am. And I think, you know, you set out on this road wanting to become a dancer, and I'm happy enough to call you dancer tonight. Ah, thank Brothers. you so much. Thanks, Brian. Thank you. That's it! Good job! Good job! Good job! Good job. Good job. Right. Well, as Brian and Arthur said, I mean, that's it. You've had your last moments on the floor, but, my goodness, didn't you use them well? <laughs> you truly did. Everything you've gained, you put out there. It was free. It was expressive. Yes. You looked at ease in everything that you did. I believe you are finishing on a high tonight. <laughs> Thank and you. And I actually think your Nana is very proud of you. Thank you so much. Very Thank proud. You. What a joy that was. Brian and Emily, everyone. Yeah, I know. It's mad. It's all done. I can't yeah. believe it's all done. It's just been an incredible experience. It's an, like, just to be here is, is fab. To be asked to do it is fab. To meet all of these great people behind the scenes, behind us right here now, it was worth it for that, mainly to make friends with Emily Barker. She is an incredible person, a really decent person. So, so Emily, I heard you got Carl a parting gift. Can you tell us about that? Yeah, so I got the only pair of shoes that is not broken. <laughs> I had them framed. <laughs> and I gave them to him. Um, so, yeah, there you yeah, go. That's great. Gift, yes. <laughs> and uh, I'm not wearing shoes tonight because they ran out of budget for shoes. <laughs> <laughs> the scores are in. The judges have their scores. Brian Redmond. From Brian to 10. <laughs> Tonight. If you think that should be Carl and Emily, then you can call 1513 or text Carl to 53125. Let's hear it for Carl and Emily. Woo!